are going now to the train market. The train is going to pass by at uh, 11 10 or 11 15. Uh, we're gonna stay here for like uh, 50 minutes or an hour. There is also a market where we can buy some food and some souvenirs. Later around uh, 11 10, 11 15. The train is going to pass by in here and people will gather around the road on the left side and the right side. It's the famous spot in here. Hello, Hello. Hello. Two four hundred fifty. Hi. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, man. Okay. So we are going to try to find that spot where the people are sitting at the cafe uh, next to the to the railway I do need something while we are waiting for the train because it's too hot in here in Malaysia, but here is very cheap. within five minutes now closing temporary just for a few, few minutes only shops are starting to close their umbrella and the people also standing along the rail Like the number of the people are queuing and gathering just to take a picture or a video near to the train. It's a big landmark in here, that's why. Here is a quick stop. Uh, the Wat Bang Kong, uh, it's a temple uh, for three gods. Uh, Buddha, the king, 
as I understand, and the ghost. Uh, so just a quick stop. We're gonna visit for 15 to 20 minutes, and we're going back to the bus. And also outside the ordination hall. For those who want to pay respect to the Buddha, you can take the flowers here and pay respect to the Buddha first, and then you also can go to see the uh, Buddha image inside the ordination hall. But for those who don't want to pay respect, no problem. You can walk around the temple, take a pictures, and then going back to the bus again. Uh, just a correction, uh, in here the blessing will be taken from three things, Buddha, King and the Spirit or the Ghost. Uh, just now I mentioned it's God, it's not God, it's Buddha, um, Spirit and the King. Uh, it's not allowed to take videos inside. So it's basically a temple. Inside there is the Buddha's statue. And the tree is climbing up above the statue. And here is the second thing I mentioned, the king's statue. So they also taking a blessing from here. This is the third thing they mentioned just now, which is uh, the spirit statue. What I understand, and I'm sorry if I'm wrong, <laughs> it's uh, a statue of a baby. So they hold the spirit of the babies when they die in an early age. Uh, they came here to the temple to let the baby uh, rest in here. We are stopping at a very famous restaurant. They talk a lot about this restaurant, so I'm excited to know what kind of restaurants. They say the king previously they used to come here. To eat so the restaurant is very beautiful inside they say and the food is very very good so we just arrived at the restaurant uh, the restaurant is quite modern actually. I, I expect it to be more uh, authentic um, but the food here is very famous uh, we ordered three meals the uh, pandan fried chicken and the pineapple fried rice and one more thing noodle but I forgot the name pronounced as a ha in Thailand so 555 five, five, I expect them to say ha 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 <laughs> I'm not sure let's see oh it's not ha 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 is it ha 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 I expected that <laughs> all right thank you this one thank you Thai people when we laughing right we we type five 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 as it's like uh, uh, European people, L O L. L O L. Yes. Laugh out loud. Thai people, we five five five, five five five. That's what I expect because I know number five is ha. Yes. So ha ha ha. Alright. Means uh, laughing. I see. Otherwise, it's a holy, holy number. Holy number. <laughs> I see. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Outside the restaurant, there is another floating floating market.
have ended our tour just now. Uh, it has been since 7 a.m. We went to five places, four or five places, I don't remember. So the tour guide just dropped us at the Jolt Market. We're gonna finish the video here and see you in the next video. Bye!